Oh, hello everyone. How are we doing? Long time no see. It's uh, me, Adam. I'm here with a little bit of an interesting video today. For once, I've actually got a video anyway. But um, today we've got a bit of an update video. It's uh, going to be broken down to probably three bits. So you can probably navigate the video a bit easier. But I'm not going to add any timestamps, so screw you. So starting off, we've got three things, as I said. We've got to go through a bit of a, uh, equipment change. I've got some new gear, which I thought you might be interested in knowing and how it relates to stuff I'm doing. Uh, second off, I've got some questions that I asked on my Discord, which you should go and join if you haven't already joined it. And finally, we have a little bit of a channel update in general, which we will be going into some stuff and, you know, yeah, stuff that I'm gonna be doing and changing, etc., etc. Anyway, I'll let um, Adam over here take over, so, you know. Thanks, Adam. So as I was uh, saying, um, I have some new equipment. You might have noticed, I look a little bit different. And that's because, well, I may have acquired, as they would say, a new camera. It's great. I love it so much. Uh, as you can probably tell, it has a better actual video capabilities, meaning we can do some more interesting videos. I can, well, in my actual, my other stuff I do, you know, my real life videos, and for the channel, obviously, but we'll cover that in the bit at the end. So, you know, uh, let me just get my old camera quickly. Uh, let me just summon it. I, I was moving the rug. You can't, don't tell me what I can and can't do. So this was the old camera I was using. It's a Canon 7D, which if you don't know is quite an old camera. Uh, it's mostly good at photography. So video wasn't its forte. Hasn't got a flip out screen. This little bad boy we have here. Let me just get rid of this. So this little bad boy we've now filming on is actually a Canon 60 Mark II. Uh, if anyone knows anything about it, you know, you probably know it's quite a decent camera. Uh, the main problems with it are that out of the camera, you know, I, I'm not going to go into it. There's a couple of things wrong with it, but there's stuff I can work around in editing and etc, etc. But the camera itself is beautiful. I'm loving the flip out screen. I've got auto focusing. So hopefully I can do a lot of new content with uh, said item. What else am I gonna, I've got to show you today? Well, why get a new camera when you can also get... Give me a moment. So I've got this uh, lovely little new gimbal. Uh, it's a DJI Ronin S. What else can I say? Uh, if you don't know what a, uh, a gimbal is, it's basically what you whack people in film or in high budget or better quality videos. They whack their camera on to stabilise the footage. So when you film with your hands, the footage always looks a bit shaky, no matter how good you are. This should take it to the next step and basically, you know, make it really good in theory. But, you know, I have to get used to it. The same with the camera. So the video quality might not be perfect yet because I haven't really tinkered around with it a whole lot. I've only set it up as quickly as I can really to film this. So uh, I was gonna unbox this on camera, but as we can see, I've already contacted DJI. It does not appear to have my gimbal in it. And that was admittedly today because I, over about a week ago, I opened it up already and I've already unboxed it because I couldn't resist the urge to use it. So um, I've actually got it over here, my dear sir. So this is the, um, the old gimbal. Admittedly, this isn't the gimbal, it's in the box, but I thought we would take a little bit of B-roll of me opening the box because I kind of want to give this a product spotlight. These things are super cool. Um, there's quite, there was quite a long waiting list for it, which I was on for ages. As soon as they announced it, I applied to get one. So uh, let's do some B-roll, I guess. enjoyed that little bit of b-roll. Uh, this is the gimbal fully assembled as you saw at the end. Um, so obviously if I didn't have the camera on the tripod right now filming me, 
we would have that bad boy slapped onto this and I could be moving around and it stabilizes it all. I'm not sure if I'm meant to move it while it's off, but here I am anyway. So what it does is it uses these motors, you know, here, here and here to stabilize the footage to the best of its abilities. It's not perfect. It's pretty good though, I have to say. And I have to say, as always, DJI products, I'm not sponsored, but I hella love it. I love a sponsor, I love your stuff. But um, the build quality is sound. It's quite heavy, even though it's meant to be, a, you know, a handheld operating one without any straps or anything. It's it's not unbearable, but I imagine it could be noticeable over like a long shoot, etc. You know, I guess we should um, put this bad boy down and we should talk about the last thing that you probably already know about. Um, if you're on my Discord, which I said earlier, go join it. I'm telling you to. Um, I got a new computer, so I can make these more, I get more complex edits quicker, etc., etc. You know, I can do, I can try more stuff without then knocking my out, myself out for a day. Like you know, for a long period of time rendering and stuff, like I used to. Like the computer I used to have was great; it worked. But when I went to render certain things, it would just take forever on very specific stuff. The new one, I'm yet to even make it slightly upset. Like, it still takes a little bit of time because of the software, but I can still, but now I can work on the computer while it's rendering without noticing any major performance drops. So, um, I would say let's go do some B-roll for that. But you might have also noticed the backdrop looks a little bit different to when I last shot here, literally probably a year ago. Um, that's because I've been reorganizing this room, uh, setting it up to do more content such as this. So I've made it into a little bit of a set, you know? So I'm gonna say, let's uh, get a little bit of B-roll of the entire bloody room. Why don't we? Next up, we have some questions uh, from Discord for people on the community, which we will be answering. Uh, I'm going to answer them up here because I, I want to make the video fresh uh, without saying the same spot for the entire thing. So, uh, Nathan asks, when was the last time you made real human contact? And I'd like to say, you know, this is real human contact, Nathan. The camera's a great listener. Yam asks, when are we going to get good content? No, Yam, it's a very serious question. I, um, I'd like to say, here at Adam Industries, we would love to get to know you and just really ask you some really detailed questions to help us improve our content for the future. Doopy asks, 
Why am I pee pee hard? You and me both, brother. A more serious question from Billy here. When are we gonna get daily uploads? Or when will we get daily uploads if I actually can read? Um, I was gonna cover this in the last bit, but I don't really plan on doing daily uploads. I would much rather do a fewer, like, fewer uploads but of a greater quality. I know you're gonna make the joke of, your quality's shit anyway, but, uh, you know, I want to, as I'm covering later, we're gonna be, I'm gonna be doing more stuff and upping the quality, so it, I can't really see myself doing daily uploads, even if I was full time. Um, so, you know, at the moment, it's mainly time constraints of my actual job, the streams, and then doing content on top. It's quite a busy, a week, you know, and then a, a week turns into a month and a year. So, in future, more uploads, but not daily. Uh, Blue or Piers then asked a load of questions that I wasn't really interested in, like, why does zero equal one? Uh, how much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? Um, oh, hype for any new games coming up? Actually, you know what, I will answer that one. At the moment, there aren't really any particular games I'm looking forward to. Um, I guess the only one I could really say is Fallout 76, but I probably won't play that on launch. I would like to watch some gameplay, so I'll probably watch some other streamers and then maybe buy it. And then we'll find out, you know, um, I'm always looking for suggestions though, so uh, feel free to at me on Discord. I love the attention with game suggestions. I'll probably regret saying that later. I made a few other ones, but I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna answer them, because this is my video and not yours. Hey, welcome to the last bit of the video. Um, we're gonna cover a little bit of a channel update. It's literally gonna take like 30 seconds, but basically, um, long story thing short, I was planning to try some new stuff. Um, by that I mean, you may have noticed I uploaded a video essay a couple of days ago, well, a couple of weeks ago, um, on YouTube, and it's like, yeah, it's okay. Uh, I've made a lot of improvements on my editing of them, so hopefully it won't take me so long as it did for this one. So I've already made, I'm already writing, slash, I'm gonna start recording it very soon. So another one coming out very soon, hopefully. Um, alongside that, with all the new equipment I've got, I can actually do vlogging now without wanting to connect, commitment, neck rope. Um, Cause I can actually, you know, do interesting things without the camera really limiting. The old camera was very limiting, is basically what I'm trying to say. So I can hopefully do some more real life stuff. So maybe some vlogging in future. We will see. Um, I'd like to call this new series uh, Dippers Unleashed. Um, you know, I don't know what else I can really show you, but maybe this cool edit, like, ah. You know, I, I don't know. Like, I wanted to really push my editing and, like, my channel. Uh, you know, I wanted to try new things, is what I'm trying to say. And that's about it, really. I hope you, um, are interested in what I have to do. I'm not gonna really elaborate on anything else because then if I elaborate on stuff, you're gonna then hold me accountable to do that stuff. So I'm not gonna tell you anything I plan to do really in detail, but I am looking at doing more stuff while I have the time. So if I, you know, if I have time, I'm gonna try and do stuff. So, you know, maybe be excited, maybe. But um, if you are interested in more content, you can always follow me on Twitter where I, you know, post nothing interesting or on Instagram. Where I do post things because I like Instagram. And uh, yeah, well, thank you guys for watching. Um, as it's the end of the video, you do that thing where you like, you know, like it and comment it so it actually gets promoted on YouTube. Because I recently found out if you don't get like quick interaction on a video, it's then deemed rubbish and they just don't promote it. So I've worked out why nothing ever gets promoted. I've also discovered putting links to other social media in a video make it less likely to be promoted. I don't understand YouTube. Anyway. A tarah. Oh, dearie me.